ready to receive everything God got for me And ain't nobody gon' stop me I was thrown in the furnace, I lived in the fire I came out short and I was destined for higher, higher Alright y'all, more packages and this ain't nothing I ordered. They just came. That box is from Tamaka. And this box on the floor is from Jazz. Get y'all back together. So, here's another pair of shoes. James is going to talk about me. He gonna talk about me because he's gonna call these what the fucks that's what he's gonna call these but i like the fact that it is a plain black tennis shoe and it gives me harachi harachi vibes um maybe a little sketcherish but they're black and that's what i liked about it that they was all black and it was uh a thick sole so he gonna talk about me he'll be like what brand is them i'm gonna be like they call what the fucks that's what i'm gonna say it's okay i want to pay for rachi money okay it's okay it's okay to be a little a little inexpensive but this little skirt this is gonna look real cute child with some opaque tights What's, what's tripping me out is I didn't I thought it was supposed to be like straight, but it got a wave. A turtleneck, a little overcoat. You know, this is gonna be a nice little pop, the bubble skirt. So this this box has a lot of what you call it? Um knits. Like thin knits. Because I don't like hot ass knits. Okay? I, I can't do them. So, the boxes from Shein tend to be a little bit more um, heavier during this time of the year. So, hold up. I'm putting all this stuff back in here because I want to do hauls. I want to do that for y'all. Keep it all the same. Okay? This is a knit sweater. That is lantern sleeved. No, it's not. It's pink and red. It's a turtleneck. Okay. And it's it's a semi-crop. It's not cropped, but semi-cropped. And it's stretchy material. Okay. This is a two-piece. Okay. Um we call the stretchy stuff. I don't have to guess or figure out if it's going to fit or not. I already know. But this is one of those sets that have the cardigan. Okay. And then it has the little knit tank dress. So this is one of those sets. You can't really judge Shein from like how it looks coming out the box. Because it's all wrinkled and shit, okay? It's all wrinkled. <laughs> Wait till y'all see how I do these. Oh, these is cool with the bungee cords. This is a form of cargos. And I just hope they fit well. The ruching is what did it for me. Okay, we have <laughs> another sweater. And this one is lantern sleeved and it's ribbed. Okay, with some little stripes. And it's a mock turtleneck. 
okay? I told y'all, I can't, I cannot wear like thick ass sweaters. My, all mine's gotta be. They gotta be um thin. If I'm gonna wear it as a, a, a fit, okay? This is the first pair of jeans I ever bought from Shein. Okay, and these are the overlap jeans. Okay, and they are super, super, super scratchy. Okay. I wanted a pair that had stretch in them, not 100% cotton, okay? Because that means I ain't gonna never wear them, okay? 100% co cotton is a cotton blocker. These are a size 30 in the waist and 32 length, and they're straight legs. Another pair of shoes. These are just so feminine, okay? So feminine, polka dots, ankle strap, nice little gold heel. The heel that it sits, you sit in the heel, okay? Not coming straight down, okay? Multifold, these are size eight. The reason I'm not trying this stuff on for y'all now is because um, I got somebody to be. And I got somebody to be. I got to keep the moving thing, okay? I'm showing y'all as I open. So this is the skirt that goes with that top. And I can wear these both separate, as separate, but today they're gonna be worn as a set. And last, this is the second pair of jeans I done ordered from Shein. And these, I don't have a coat. I didn't have a high waist. I don't know if I'm, this, this don't look helpful. We shall see, okay? But these are wide legs. Now, I'm gonna have to cut them and wash them again so they can fray back up. But I need these to be my length, not like dragging um the flow but this is a good deep blue for fall winters so that completes everything that was in that bag i mean that box i reuse these bags y'all when i be traveling i take a shein bag and i'll make it my laundry bag in my um look Vaughn got two more pieces. Let's see who came over here. Yeah. Oh, this is too little. I ain't gonna even try you like this, Vaughn. I don't know though. It's scratch. He said, I love my papa. See? Okay, this is our first time buying clothes for him from Shein. And I think now that I know he's gonna have to need them. He's gonna need a, the medium. Cause this small look like a medium, okay? James will pick at barn. He will. But this says I love my mother. So at least it was a dollar, dollar ninety nine. So if he can't wear it, I'm not completely shit out of luck. You know what I'm saying? Box from Jazz. Dossier perfume. So let's see. I'm trying to figure out how you know what what name it is. So this one is Flora Flora a a da That's the name, okay? And these are expensive brands that's duped. They done got duped. My dossier. So this one has Yang Yang, Jasmine, May Rose. Sandalwood is the base note. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to, um. Okay. 
Okay, Iconic Scents, Designer Quality, No Markups. The one I'm dying to smell is the one I think is by Mark Jacobs. Fucking fabulous. This one is called Flory, Floral Honeysuckle. Um, and okay, so the first one is inspired by Chanel number no. five. I thought this smelled something similar. It does. Okay, that's Chanel number no. five. This one is Gucci Bloom. And this is the floral honeysuckle. Just smell like Gucci Bloom because I have, I just got, I had, I had a little corner left. Just a little corner. This smells like it. Mm. Okay. Ambery Sage. And this one is inspired by Tom Ford. Fucking fabulous. Okay. Let's see. smells fucking fabulous. Bitter almond, sage, lavender are the top notes. Middle notes are leathery notes, orris, vanilla, and base notes, amber, blonde woods, and tonka bean. And this is 18% concentration. Oh, this smells delightful. That's amberly Ambery, Ambery Sage. Okay. You am going to perfume for a minute. There was only one perfume that's on my radar right now, and that is this Versace um, perfume, Versace Bright Crystal. Okay. This has pomegranate. I noticed something. Jasmine got like. Oh, this smells good. Oh, yeah, this smells really, 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 really good. Fruity Magnolia. This is a ins inspiration by Versace Bright Crystal. Oh, that smells delicious. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I couldn't wait to get this. I cannot. To make this, she was struggling on how to package this. So, let's see what this got. Not the bubble paper. Clearly, this is some art. Oh my god, I see the black artist. <laughs> she got me the other part of the set. She be paying attention, Grace. She be paying attention. I like when people pay attention. No, I'm a little weak. Okay. Yes. Uh, it completes my set. Oh, yes. The girl with the big afro. Oh, I love this. I love this. I love this. 
go, Kendra Dandy from Pennsylvania. I have a couple of her uh, collection pieces in here. Okay. Oh my, ugh. I love it. I love it. Now we're going to keep all of this. Because you just never know when you might need something to stir. Okay. Let me put all this in this bag. Just it out. Okay, let's put it all in this bag. somewhere. Gracias, Mika. Gracias. Thank you for paying attention, sis. I love when people pay attention, Craig. I love it. Okay. So, y'all, I'm finna go because it's 12.30. Jada gotta be somewhere at 2.30. And I got some, some stuff to do so I can get dressed before I walk out my door. However, comma, I have no energy for that other box right now. I know. So, let me get dressed, and then maybe I'll come back later on and finish the rest. How about that? All right, y'all. So, um, just leaving the thrift store, um, went and did... A little sourcing yet um, I was really particular today with the sourcing okay um, with the sourcing with the intent that it's for me okay so y'all I'm tired of eating out Excuse me, I'm tired of eating out. So, I want to cook something. But I need to cook something that's not going to require me to be, you know, getting it in, okay? So, I'm about to go by Target right quick. I'm really out here just killing time because Jada had an appointment and I'm just trying to stay out while she's out. Um, Y'all normally I be in the wind, but I know I wasn't gonna be traveling like far away today. So um, I think it's like my second time driving. <sighs> second third maybe um I'm gonna tell you I'm hungry I'm hungry but you know how you got food in the house but everything needs to be prepared in order to eat so that's the predicament I'm in right now got grocery you just don't want to cook but that's the only way you gonna eat is if you cook so I need to go out to to what I needed to get from Target I wrote it down I wrote it down it's on a piece of paper in my um, purse I can easily get sidetracked y'all okay so now And I know as soon as I go home, she gonna call me and say, she ready, she done. 
So I'm praying for all of my Florida family, nieces, and friends. Um, I know y'all been getting some weather. Um, I think we are getting some of that weather, that residual weather, um, just because it's cloudy like a mug today, and it look like it's gone po. Okay. So. Um, I talked to my mom, my sisters, um, trying to get a hold of um, one of our friends that live there too, just to make sure they are right because Florida done been kind of um, blessed uh, in the past couple of years because they haven't had any. <sighs> They haven't had any hurricanes that could potentially turn into a category five okay so i am just keeping everybody in prayer however i know we'll get some of the residual of that towards the end of the week um because it's it looked like it's gonna pull down raining okay that's why I'm ready to go home. Okay. I wanna go get me some snacks. And I wanna I wanna go home. Um sometimes y'all I don't like wasting good outfits. However, <laughs> outfit is an outfit, okay? And this is how y'all look at it. You better wear these clothes while you have the opportunity and you just never know who you may run into while out so to me to be honest just always look your best and you can feel your best and you can be your best okay um which is like this is, this is went into this consignment shop and as soon as i walked in the door i was listening to something in my ear completely uh not paying the lady who was talking to me and the teacher but she was asking me like where did I get my dress from and I told her this is a two piece and this is a really cute two piece y'all from um, Shein and it's the lightweight it's um, it's not thin but it's not thick it's good quality material however Cuomo uh, I definitely Wear this again this season. I will definitely. I will definitely. But I wear my clothes. And my mama always be asking me that. Do you wear your clothes? I'm like, Mama, no. Question is, do you wear your clothes? Because my mama got three full closets in her house. Granted, I got one full closet. Okay. Um. same time y'all I do wear my stuff I do it's just that um I've been a chick down this summer so the summer wardrobe and the summer shopping I had did prior to summer okay some of them things can be transitioned into fall and winter because you can always layer okay yet those season missed just know I'm ready for next year though okay okay so um as i was telling y'all earlier when i was doing that unboxing and taking stuff out i just wanted some knits that i could play with in the rest of my wardrobe and mix and match and mix something to fast fashion with some vintage or something secondhand um y'all know me child my outfit do not got to be um I, I i like labels but i'm not um a label whore look on my future car look on my future car yes y'all i want either a bug a, a volkswagen convertible bug or i want a coupe i do i want a little car because my husband going to always keep a big car, a big truck. Because he he say he like the whole shit. Don't ask me where that came from because I don't know. 
how come um I just not I don't I don't like not having a plan okay like today I knew I was taking her to go do this appointment however Mm -mm. I don't know. Maybe because I don't know, I'm gonna get off because I'm just yapping now, okay? I ain't got nothing to talk about. So. Okay, y'all gonna have to see this fit today because this is a real cute two piece from Shein. I'll let y'all see it. I'm kind of in a hurry right now. So, to be continued. And if you ain't want to check out that story time, go check it out. It's on YouTube, it's live right now. Hmm. So I am back home and I'm gonna show y'all this fit, okay? I'm gonna show y'all this fit, okay? Now my mama said I look like Medusa child. I look like Medusa with the snakes coming out of here, but it's okay. It's okay. Don't get mad at them. Don't, don't. So this part right here has nice cutout detail. I do have on an animal print bra, so I'm just letting it do what it do, peek out, okay? We have the hoodie, and then here's the two-piece. Boom, okay, boom. So it is a skirt, a bodycon skirt. Has a split. It has the split going up the middle, so it's just showing a little skin, just a little bit. Got on the Doc Martens. There's the little dog. So yes. Two piece by Shein has the lantern sleeves, cuteness, cuteness, and I just got my birthday gift from Nika. Thank you, girl. My set is complete. Boom and boom. Yes. Okay. So. Let me get ready to take these clothes off. That's why I'm going to show y'all this outfit while I had to check the clothes still on. Because I'm ready to come about these clothes. Okay, so y'all, I'm just giving y'all a little preview of some items that, you know, I was trying to decide if I was going to keep for myself or if I was going to um, put it up in a live sale. Now, this uh, tie-dye blazer, child, I'm surprised that nobody's cropped that right quick because I would have. Ooh, honey, and this Halston, like, dust up, baby. This is perfect for serving, hosting some guests. You know what I'm saying? Honey, this two-piece right here, I'm surprised I still got it, too. I tell y'all, I'll give y'all first dibs. You don't get it's going to become man, okay? All these items are available for purchase. If you are interested, just hit your girl up and let me know, okay? Honey, maxi and mint. Honey, I'm feeling it, okay? Feeling it. Now, honey, this is some definitely some boho chic, okay? Very free people-ish. It's very sheer. And just some biking shorts and a little sports bra underneath it, honey. You instant cute. And this is like my fave. Fave, fave. And no, I did not show y'all this in the live sale. However, you never know. Just ask. Hey, it's your girl Steph. Hey, it's your girl Steph. And y'all, y'all know me as uh, Eco Like Me, Steph Professor. And hello, and hello, and hello, and hello, and hello, and more. So it is Thrifty Tuesdays, okay? So I decided today I'm going to take you all thrifting with me. Um, I had to run some errands today. Therefore, I was like, you know what? Let's just stop by a couple of thrift stores. So I just left one. And if y'all been rolling with me, you've been rolling with me. You heard the story about me and the grandma almost, <laughs> me, grandma, and Maria almost got into it, okay? Over at the spot that um, she was getting on my nerves at. I just left from over there and um, I just... I forgot what I was doing today. So I was like, girl, you going to the second spot. So let's get it together while you can. Okay. So I did buy something from there. And I had like one, two, three. I had like four gems in my hand. However, I left three and only came back with one. I found this beautiful white, like poetic, like blouse something prince would wear definitely okay but it was too small 
black um velvet teen long vest it was too small uh a aqua blue uh kimono um with the dragon and it was a maxi length one the only reason i left that was because for it to be 100 percent silk i know how it go okay when you go to wash launder that ain't coming out okay and it was spots and like obvious spots like I was like, oh, not worth it. So I left that as well. And I also saw this fly as red sequined pant two piece. Okay. I tried the jacket on and it said, hey, oh no. So y'all, I'm trying to be more cautious when I'm shopping for myself because today is not a day for me to be shopping for y'all. However, y'all know I'm always looking at for y'all so i'm at this spot it's called we call it the purple building but it is consignment and more and i'm gonna go in here and see what they got they normally have some gems this is where i find a lot of my like free people at and this is more like a consignment store versus a thrift store so let's go check my mailbox my p.o box so i make it part of the journey cute but that's all it is cute okay this is a cute michael kors canvas bag it's in here for 32 like the fringe and the drawstring. Let's see. It's a cute little bag too. Alright, so y'all, I'm gonna gather some things. And let's see what we could find. But this is the overview of what it looks like. And I gotta get my bearings so my radar can be turned all the way on, okay? Not partially. And I'll gather some things and I'll show y'all what I get. Another feature that I like about this particular consignment shop is it's a furniture. And I love it. I love it. So now you see um, knickknacks, all kinds of furniture, from mid-century modern to um, modern, contemporary. I have a few pieces that are in my house from here. One of the things that um, I know y'all see in my house is this um, dresser that's in my diva den. And this is a nice character. That's a 
desk. That is really nice. It just look like. Interesting. This is what I was telling y'all about going thrifting on holidays. Yesterday was Columbus Day, and you see my cart is empty. Okay, so your girl is exiting stage left. Today wasn't a good day to come here. It wasn't. Um, mainly because, like I said, everything gets shopped over. Literally. So, next on the agenda, Lock your doors. That's what you need to do. Lock your mother effing doors. Cause child, by any means possible, they out here trying to get us y'all, okay? And they don't care if it's man, woman, child, old, young, decrepit, they don't care, okay? So, I'm going to venture off to the next spot. However, comma, just for a reference, y'all yeah, remember that black and white tie-dye um, blazer that um, I had bought and also the black zippered cropped version you can wear it cropped or you can wear it as a long line blazer um and it was something else that i bought from there that all came from that spot right there so i'm sharing some of my gems now when i first go into thrift store y'all i do have a routine i do have a routine and my routine is hold up why is all this Ooh, okay. Um, my routine is depending on the layout of the thrift store. If it's a consignment shop like that, I check out the accessories first, just like how you saw me do. Um, they don't never have colors or anything like that on sale in that particular consignment shop. Um, but um. That's another thing I do since I walk in the door. I look to see what the color of the day or the week is. So, once I figure that piece out, then I generally go to the accessories. I'm talking about all the accessories. I check out the jewelry, the handbags, scarves, um, belts, shoes, hats. I check out all that stuff first, okay? Because that is stuff that is constantly being replenished throughout the day, okay? And when I, right before I get ready to leave, I circle back around and do it again, okay? Then, after I've checked out all the accessories, then I go straight to the coats. Coats, in this order, coats, 
dresses, mm, suiting, blazers, because suiting and blazers is normally right by each other. Suiting and blazers and The last thing I check out is blouses, any type of sweaters, tops, um, and like athleisure wear. Then I hit, the last section I hit is the men's section, okay? I peruse through there, okay? Then, here lately, um, I've been wanting to get into doing some estate sales and um, I signed up on the app so that I get notifications and this upcoming weekend I'm going to get out and go do some estate selling because you got to be up bright and early most start at nine o'clock um, I think this week I'm gonna try to do some on Friday um, the ones that are like local within my area and then on Saturday that's when I'm gonna venture out. I'm gonna venture out like the 30, 40 mile radius, okay? I'm gonna venture out. And this is something like even my husband has been wanting to do with me. Um, He's been wanting to go estate sale shopping too. He has different things that he's looking for, y'all. He's looking for gardening. He's looking for a snowblower. He's looking for a lawnmower. I'm going to give him a lawnmower. I am. Because he wants the one that is eco-friendly. And that is pretty much, you plug it up. Yep, that's what James wants, y'all. He want to be eco-friendly. He already got a plug up. What you call it? Um, edger. And he wants a weed whacker. And he wants a lawnmower. The long more this brother won't five dollars. Look, I don't complain because you know what? My husband tolerates my habits, okay? My habits of always got to be hunting for shit, okay? The least I could do. You know what I'm saying? I might have to end up getting the brother a dog on um you know, you know. Okay. So now y'all we are at the Salvation Army. And let me just get my life together right quick. Pump, pump. Still be doing my sanitizer, okay? <sighs> Hold up. Need a little water because I'm feeling a little porched. Auntie Life's Joy and Bianca, y'all be proud. I'm drinking the water. The water is with me, okay? However, karma. Let's get in here and see what we about to get into. So today is a no makeup day. It is, but I am dressed, honey. I'm dressed. Got on the chucks, star run hikes. Got on the, um, hold on. I'm not used to vlogging with my phone wall. But because my shit ain't charged, I ain't got no choice if y'all want to be a part of this today. So let go. The Family Salvation Army Store. I love the Salvation Army. Oh, that is cuteness already, I see. Okay. Cuteness. She is cute. So clearly this is a costume. Ask me do I care. She's a groovy ass bitch. Okay. Groovy. So the colors today are 50% off. White, pink, and blue. Blue is 99 cents. So I'm going to park my um cart right there. I'm going to just peruse the shoes as such. I never bought the little thing. The little 
look hurry slip because I knew eventually that's how you get neutral shit y'all get neutral you want to do a trend do do neutral wife of the party that is me okay okay so you can find some cute shoes up in the thrift store however comma you have to inspect it because shoes do rot okay they do rot they do get old and they ain't quite the same let's look so y'all metallics is is the thing for the season uh, y'all already know what i'm about to say hold up it ain't opening i see something gold though well, that's cute that one one's cute too but she don't want to open and i got time to be fighting okay and that's fine period so this is it for them when it comes to um accessories and y'all just to time stamp it try my damn watch please good okay y'all this blazer look like that um that china that your grandma had and i know that because i got some of that china from my grandma so hmm. i'm gonna keep y'all out so y'all can see if something just jumps out at me because as you can see, I really be scrolling. Okay? I legit be scrolling. Scrolling. Okay, coat. Oh. What is this kicking out right here? Okay. Okay. Hmm. Now, this is all the houseware stuff as you shop. And generally, something got to jump out with me on that one too. Okay, so I have got some furs. Ooh, I like the color of this one. Ooh. Oh, where's the ticket? Now, this is the bad thing, y'all. If you don't have a ticket, they won't sell it. The ticket is gone. This one is a nice one, too. Hold on, just that one. Oh, this one got a couple of rips. Okay. Keep it moving. Hi. Right. I'm sorry. Unless one of y'all requests the coat, I ain't buying no more coat. And I'm going to tell you why. If you said last year, you know your girl had to do a purge. Okay? I had to purge and sell a lot of coats. This is a nice London fog. It has the belt. And this is a nice leather like the long wear coat. Oh, this is not. That one is not. Okay. Okay. So let's continue 
Because y'all going to see that I go through this pretty fast. You have to catch my attention at the door. Like, for real. You got to catch my attention at the door. This is too much for me. This is too much. Okay? It's kind of cute. Jada would like that. But I don't buy my daughter's clothes no more, y'all. And I'm going to tell you why. Because I'm that mother. If I buy you something, I want to see you wear it. If you don't wear it, <laughs> I'm done with you. Okay. And that's my period. Okay. See, today is the day after a holiday. And ain't nothing popping on nothing. Okay. Nice, man. Walk the pants. Do what we find in some pants or some shorts. Hmm. I can tell y'all right now, I'm not about to be in here long. Mm -mm. I'm attracted to print. And you'll be surprised that while I'm like perusing, I look at um I'm looking at leg counts that says a lot. Uh oh what is this? Okay. That's a two T. Child, what toddler wearing that? Always check out the lingerie. Tops and bottoms. Sometimes you'll find some cute bottoms tucked away. It ain't supposed to be dark. Now, y'all, I can shop two aisles at the same damn time. I can. I don't have to be in the store all day. I'll be ready to like move on to the next. Okay. What is this? DKNY. I don't see no size. This is cute. See? And they have stains and shit like this. Some things just let you know immediately they ain't coming out. Now the cargo trend is definitely a vibe I'm liking because it's gonna take us from fall and winter to spring as well. Okay. Jada had on these. Cute cargo pants a couple weeks ago. And I was like, where did you get them from? She was like, Mommy, I got those from Shein. I was like, okay, I ain't know. So I pay attention to print. Not all print is equal though, okay? Yep, I can tell y'all right now. I'm really not about to be in here this long. Because what I got my eye on, I'm not seeing. Okay. So, I like this 
see when they print out these racks. I like to see that. The skirt section. They look a little blur from where I'm standing. So the Autumn Halloween costume. Pitiful. Pitiful. Okay, y'all. Until I find something, I'll be there. So, this is definitely given. Ranch, ranch, auntie vibes. Okay, pretty, pretty color. Here's a pocket. Yeah. Both sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a comma. I'm gonna leave this here. Shoulders. And this is why I'm leaving it here. It's ripped. This is an easy repair, but whoever owned it didn't take good care of it. Okay? So, oh, look, y'all. The whole damn thing just came off. I can't do it. Okay, let me put it back. And just like that, I'm walking to my car. I was in there probably 20 minutes. 20 minutes, if that, okay? If. Ciao. Yes, this is picky, okay? And like I said, It's real hard to come behind a holiday and shop. Lock your doors as soon as you get in the house. Get in the car, y'all. Okay? All right. So, I have one more place I could hit before I venture back to the house. But... I got another tip for y'all. Three things you don't buy from the thrift store. Pay attention, okay? I'm gonna give y'all three today. But in future Thrifty Tuesdays, I'm gonna show y'all some of the shit you should not buy, okay? So, one of the things that you do not buy from the thrift store is snowballs okay y'all know the things that you shake up it's got snow and half the time they play music don't buy that shit okay you don't never know what spirit can be attached to that okay um snow globes jewelry boxes that play music as well stay away I know it's a given. Don't be buying nothing that look like Annabelle, okay? No vintage dolls, nothing. Because you don't know what evil has been attached to that doll baby, okay? Leave her ass right there on the shelf, okay? I know y'all watched the movie Annabelle, okay? Don't do it. Now... Another another thing that I learned here recently, it's not good to buy mirrors from the thrift store. It's so sad that we live in a world where if we expect people to be good, you have to expect that there is evil out there too. And people just be doing some stuff and child, I believe in the Lord, my my Lord and Savior. Um, I believe in God. That's my Father. Child, He be telling everybody I'm I'm one of His children. Okay, 
baby daddy um and it's okay okay however like i said thank you sir so nice okay let's see what a smile i get you um you just never know you never ever ever just you never know you never know what ill intent people um have in store for you so i keep my sage spray blessed sage spray and i spray over my stuff okay and i always even though i'm bringing it in the house and it's gonna be laundered i am always still going to spray it down with sanitizing spray that's made by um clorox or lysol that is specifically made for clothing so i'm going to always use that okay even before I put it in my washing machine. Okay, okay. But mirrors, that that was like a bummer for me because I have been looking for me like I wanted like a nice antique like mirror, and um, I have come across a few at the thrift stores in the past but in the past they don't want to sell them to you they want to keep them for the people who on the sales floor trying stuff on so i just don't be bothered with it i just don't i just said antique mirror i'm gonna have to go purchase at an at-home wayfair cb2 one of those type places because i'll be damned okay look in the mirror and see see what's the damn american horror story see um bloody mary's looking back at my ass oh no i'm gonna leave your ass right there sis okay okay so that kind of concludes my thrifting venture today. I was able to take y'all into two stores, a consignment shop that I'm like really like sad that they didn't have anything today. And second, um, the Salvation Army, which mm, it was like that. Um, I could pop into the Goodwill. <sighs> Today is Tuesday, and on Tuesdays, my Goodwill, they like to restock. So, I got one more place. I'm going to pop y'all in, and we're going to go see. And then, that's going to be the end of thrifting for us today, okay? Because... And I'm going to tell y'all, the best time to go thrifting is first thing in the morning. First thing in the morning. Now, that thrift store that I went to in Passaic, New Jersey, okay, because they have happy hour, I can get up and I can go hit my route that I like to hit amongst, you know, the thrift stores that I like to hit that's further northwest. Um... I can plug that into like that'd be like my last spot and then I'm coming home because honey from four to eight is happy hour and just something that you might have in your cart might be 50% off. Okay, so I could do that. I could do that. So I have a route for those days when um they're doing those sales. Take a picture, it'll last longer. Ooh, sorry y'all y'all saw my bed i just hate when you look over and people is like staring at you okay take a picture y'all yesterday i was in walmart let me tell y'all what happened to me i was in walmart minding my business and i was looking for this garnier um permanent hair color right um because it's oil it's oil infused or something like that Khadija told me that this was more like a natural way to color your hair back dark because honey the rinse failed me okay it, it failed me 
So I was on the aisle looking for that, and then this older man, he, he, was, he was like well into his late 50s, early 60s. He was handsome. I ain't blind now, y'all. I'ma tell y'all that. I ain't blind. He was handsome, yet I had on my mask, okay? And he was like, um, he walked by me and he was like, damn. And I said, you all right? He was like, girl, he was like, you are just beautiful with the mask on and all. He said, it's them eyes, honey. And there was a woman walking behind him, y'all. And I was like, I, I, I'm, I show respect. He's saying all of this, and I'm looking at the woman that's with him, behind him. And I'm like, he's like, that's my mama. That's my mama. And then she was, she was just smiling. She had a mask on, too. She was smiling, and she was like, yes. And she said, and you also see she is unavailable. He said, mama, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that immediately. Because I was on FaceTime with Jasmine and Jada and talking to them. And so my hand was up in the air. It was. And he was like, okay, I see. She taken. She off the market. He said, but honey, he said, I ain't blind. He said, and when I when I see beauty, he was like, you got to give women they, res um, they flowers now. And he said, and respect the fact that... You know what? We already well, we already have a bunch of disrespectful ass. Damn, I wish I would have got that. Girl, you need to take that back in the store so I can get it. She got a wicker hamper and it look like it is in mint condition, okay? He said, like, but when I see a beautiful woman, I let her know. He said, like, cause you never know. When the last time I, when the last time somebody told her she was beautiful, and I said, "God bless you," I said, "Thank you." But well, right before I left my house, my baby daddy told me. So now y'all see we are at the Goodwill. Let's see what they got. Everything got been shopped over. You see it? We got new racks out. New racks. But ain't nothing jumping out at me. Hence, why y'all did not see me pick up a cart. This is a cute little coat for a shorty. This one is cute too. This is adorable. What size is this? Let's see. Oh God, I cannot see. I gotta use y'all. Mm -hmm. Hey. Can I go down your way? Yes, you can. Thank you. What are you trying to bring out the new one? Good out to you. This is a cow rug. Oh, this might be have to go to the house with me. What time is it? Oh, I thought it was wool. Is it? It it's, might it's be. A, it's a cow rug. Oh my God, it is beautiful. Right? It's real one. Yes, I it's think. a real one. Enjoy. Let me, let me go get it. a car. Oh, I think it's heavy. This is a fine dog. This is a fine. Oh, yeah. No, I know. Oh, that is a fine, <laughs> honey. Like, all right. I'll give you six dollars. Have a good day. All you have to do is vacuum. Okay, fifteen 
Let's see, what is this? This is a maxi dress. It's him. See, I told y'all on Tuesday, this one, they like to restock. And this is a fabulous cow rug. And I'm not putting back. Do y'all know how much these rugs cost? I was in at home yesterday. Oh, that's some cute patchworks. Um, I really like this. I don't see how big it is. I like blankets and throws and stuff, y'all, throughout the house. Because I tell y'all, I keep my house cold. Okay, they're gonna blaze this. Let's see what they got. Oh, what is this? A big ass bag. Okay, let's see. Do I worry about my car? Not in here. There ain't a lot of heathens in here today. Okay? I ain't got nothing to worry about. Y'all, let's check these out. Too. But I don't like boots that you can't um, unzip and put on. I always feel like I'm fighting to get in them. I need a zipper exit. Okay. I don't see nothing jumping out at me. Nothing. Oh, it's some, some cute luggage here too. My mama found a cute luggage set. She found the matching set in two different spots, okay? Okay, ain't nothing jumping out at me. Ain't nothing jumping out at me. I'm not having a moment. I am not having a moment. But this cow rug, baby. I'm just gonna go home and vacuum and spray some. Some bissel on it. Okay. Vacuum and BM. See, this is the go back rack. There's the mirror. Okay. Let me see how big this is. I really like this. 